hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel i have a ton of books to unbox and i am so 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 excited i have literally been putting this off for way too long but there are some absolute gems in this unboxing so i can't wait for you guys to watch and let me know what you think let me know if you've recently gotten any of these books or if you want to get any of these books i also do have codes with some of these companies that sent me some boxes so i will have that link down below in my description box a lot of these i just purchased with my own money and enough rambling let me just show you guys the books and the boxes of books that I've accumulated over the past few months so first up we have this super cute package and honestly don't know who this is from where this is from so let's open this up I just love the way it's wrapped Ooh, okay so this book is called Promposal and it's by Rachel Garrett. Little Brown actually sent this. To pursue her dream, she'll have to team up with the boy who broke her heart. Ooh, I like this. So this is a YA romance. It's like a YA high school romance, which I haven't read one of those in a really long time, but the premise of this one sounds really good. Okay, so the next box is actually from this company called Fox Wit. Wait. Fox and Wit. I think I do know exactly what this is. Instead of using a knife or scissors like a normal person i'm using these pair of tweezers so i might have to go grab a pair of scissors Ooh, okay so i got this stunning oh okay sorry about that i got this stunning edition of things we never got over by lucy score so this is obviously a special edition and what just fell um was this signed book plate you can't see the signature i don't think but if you can it's there and it is so adorable so it's just like the regular cover under here um i don't remember if the book was signed i thought it was supposed to be or maybe not but yeah on the back it has like the little dog so i actually have not read this book i did read the first five chapters and i really enjoyed it so when i saw that this company was doing a special edition of it i was like i need it now so next up we have a package and this is from bloom books i believe Ooh, okay i literally just like threw the bag on the floor so this is king of wrath by anna huang i haven't read any of anna huang's books but i do really want to get into them i did start twisted love haven't finished it that's going to be a common theme because i am very much a mood reader and sometimes i'll be like reading the first it usually takes me the first five chapters before i'm like mm, i'm not in the mood for this and the book could be amazing has amazing writing whatever the case is but i'm just not specifically in the mood to read it and that always happens to me whenever i try to start the twisted series um but i do really want to start it <gasps> wait this is so cute uh, oh my gosh this is like a wedding invitation okay i did not know that this book was marriage of convenience but looking at the cover there's literally a ring on there <laughs> so that's on me but this wedding invitation is so cute i'm gonna do a little close-up but it says dv dante russo and vivian lao request the pleasure of your company at the ceremony of their wedding saturday september 2nd at 2 p.m 2023 i still have time to rsvp <laughs> oh my gosh at lake como italy i actually wish that this was a real couple getting married because i've always wanted to go to italy especially lake como anyways i'm obsessed with that wedding invitation so thank you so much to bloom books for sending that to me the next package is also from bloom books and it's like in this really pretty rose gold next two books are beg you to trust me and dare you to hate me and these are both by b celeste so these follow two different characters it's like one of those series i'm assuming it just takes place in like the same school because both of the guys in on the covers are football players we love a good football romance, okay? I used to eat up football romances on Wattpad and just in general growing up, like when I would read contemporary. So I'm pretty sure B. Celeste writes new adult. This is gonna be very interesting. On here it says the tropes for beg you to trust me are college romance, slow burn, friends with benefits, football romance, angsty app, and hashtag me too. And then does it have for the other book? I don't see what the tropes are for this specific book but yeah i'm excited to read these for those of you wondering which none of you guys are probably wondering but i'm going to tell you anyways it is currently 
one in the morning or it's like almost one and I have a flight to catch tomorrow because I'm going to New York and if you don't follow me on Instagram you would know but I was in New York last month and I'm going again for a really exciting reason and also to just meet one of my online besties I'm like swinging the scissor around that's so dangerous I'm going to meet one of my online besties we've already met we actually met last month was it last month or was it in May? So I am filming this video because I cannot put it off any longer. So I want everyone to be proud of me, okay? I am trying to take a hold of my ADHD and my procrastination and get ahead of it. And I think I did that. Okay, next up we have a fairy loot package. So I genuinely do not know what it is. Wow, opening that with scissors was way easier. Oh, they gave like these little popcorn thingies. My room is gonna be an absolute mess <gasps> this is so pretty okay so this just is like a little fairy loot card i literally forgot i ordered this oh, oh. <laughs> almost dropped that but i literally forgot i ordered this so this is the fairy loot edition of the stolen air and this is so gorgeous on the back it says a runaway queen a reluctant prince and a quest that may destroy them both oh my gosh oh wow <gasps> this is so crazy okay and then the sprayed edges are gold Is my dog trying to get in my room leave it to fairy loot to absolutely slay one of their special editions i started the stolen air as well and it was another one of the situations where i started it but i wasn't in the mood for it but i've been like eating up ya fantasy again so i cannot wait to start this especially after seeing this beautiful edition it's so gorgeous it's gonna look beautiful on my shelves when i finally reorganize them which God knows when that will happen. Wow, all of these additions are just making me so freaking happy. Next up, I have another huge package from Bloom Books. There are a ton of books in that box, but I'm just gonna show you guys this two series that they sent. They sent me the Sinners... They sent me the Priest series, not the Sinner series. I'm thinking of a completely different one. But I actually read Priest by Sierra Simone. It was really good. I started Saint, which I think is the second book, and... It was also really good i just never ended up finishing it but these covers can we talk about them for a second this is saint like this is absolutely gorgeous wait actually i think this one might be the second book this one's sinner um and i think the main or the main love interest the girl wants to become a nun or something i don't know this this book was crazy like what i read of it so far but it was really good and priest was also insane um so if you want some like crazy smut read these <laughs> and they also sent me the american what is this series called the new camelot camelot series is that how you say that comes with american prince american king and then american queen this cover is gorgeous i actually really like this it reminds me a lot of like the early 2010s ya covers that we were getting although this is definitely not ya i'm literally sweating it's getting hot in here and that's not just because of the books and the content inside of them this next package is actually a very 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 special one it is from kathy's bookish shop so she is a small business owner and she specializes in sprayed edges so she takes her time to basically get your input on what type of sprayed edge you would like on a set of books or your favorite book and she will make a design for you and ship it to you basically i did choose a preset sprayed edges that she had on her website and i do have a code with her but i will tell you guys at the end oh wow the packaging is just like absolutely immaculate this is how it looks so far she has the books wrapped in this gorgeous paper with calligraphy all over it and even like a little wax seal with this print i like, don't even want to open this but i'm going to because i want you guys to see how gorgeous these are i have yet to see them in person wow these are definitely wrapped very well obviously as you can tell i got the song of achilles by madeleine miller and then i also got cersei by the same author let's get a little commotion for these sprayed edges okay these are absolutely gorgeous so this is like the special edition i believe and like the bottom is blue and it has like the gold foiled leaves and then this one has black 
but like it's gold foil these as well and they just complement each other so nicely this is beautiful so i've been wanting to read these books for so long and now that i have these stunning beautiful editions of these i will definitely be reading them as soon as possible oh wow okay so she even sent me some extra goodies this is a moon phase bookmark which like if you don't know this about me i love the moon i love the stars astrology anything to do with that kind of stuff i'm all here for it and at any given moment of the day or night i know what phase the moon is in so this bookmark is just perfect oh my goodness this is a necklace and a earring set and it is the sun so the earrings are the sun and the necklace is the sun i'm literally taking this with me to new york and then she sent me another one and these are daggers i love it so much wow and then i don't know what these are i think these are just like wax seals with a sticker as well so she did give me a code to share with you guys if you liked these gorgeous sprayed edges you can use the code nika5 to get five percent off your purchase in her shop i will have everything linked down below in my description so it's easily accessible to you guys so thank you so much kathy and i can't wait to display these okay so next up we have this package and this is from eternal embers oh my gosh it came I came with prints. If you did not already guess what book that's from, it is the special edition of Trist Six Venom by Penelope Douglas. And it's in a slip case. Ugh, hold on. Oh my gosh, this is not coming out. Wow. This is absolutely gorgeous. I can't remember if the book is signed, but I really don't want to open it yet because I'm not ready to display it on my bookshelves and I just want it to be in like pristine condition when I finally am ready to display it. So for now, I'm going to keep it in its original packaging. I guess, wait, I should tell you guys what it says. But on the back it says, it's like being in her orbit. I can feel the shine too. I feel bigger with her clothes. <laughs> I could cry. I love, love, love this book. I literally do like a reread ever since it came out in what, like 2020? Every year, I have to. I have to get my fix of Clay Olivia. Okay, so next up, I got another package from Bloom Books. If you can't tell, Bloom Books spoils me, and I absolutely love them. So, love you, Bloom Books. If you're watching this, you're probably not, but if you are, so Bloom Books sent me over the entire twisted series i had been wanting to read these books for so long i don't know if you guys can see them because my exposure all right next up i have this massive package from lit joy crate which i have already opened oh my god what is that oh my god what is that it came with the scarf so this is the lit joy crate special edition of the red queen series by victorian aveyard of course no one ever tells you this but unboxing books is literally a workout because getting this box of books out of the box that it was inside of <gasps> these are just so stunning fun fact it actually glows in the dark like this box set glows in the freaking dark i'm not gonna take every single book in the series out but this is just the first book and it's absolutely stunning actually i will show you guys every single one because it's too pretty for me not to but this is the first book red queen and it has blood dripping on the sprayed edges and in the back it says anyone can betray anyone which is like a little bit too true in the series so then this is the second book and this is cow on the cover of glass sword it also has you know the sprayed dripping edges and it says on here lightning has no mercy and i didn't show you the first book oh yeah these are all signed by the way but the end papers are just gorgeous amazing so it has all of victoria aveyard's annotations inside you cannot see that at all but they're right there i think that this is maven i can't remember which one is which they look very similar i'm pretty sure this is maven's because this book really heavily focuses on maven but yeah so he's on the cover of this one this one says monsters are most dangerous when they are afraid war storm and i haven't read the series in a really long time but i'm pretty sure this is evangeline just like the artwork on the inside is absolutely insane and then this is broken throne so then kathy lockhart actually sent me the lives we tell this entire series in this crazy box and i'm not gonna take all of them out but this is all of the books i believe it's a small town romance i'm so out of breath right now 
thank you so much to Kathy for sending me these books. I was just like absolutely in awe at the packaging and the amount of thought that went into this. So next up we have the, well these are huge, but we have the Illumicrate Special Editions of Crescent City. These are massive. Are the UK versions just like way bigger than the US versions? Like this is insane. Yeah, they, they definitely have to be bigger. I don't think it has special content inside. I'm gonna scream. Oh. Okay, I have not seen these. Like I have been avoiding spoilers as much as I possibly can, but these are reversible. You guys, this is amazing. I'm so obsessed with this. Are these signed? These are definitely signed, right? I don't know if they're signed. No, I don't think they are. You know, oh, we have La Hava on here. Oh, don't make me sad. These are just as gorgeous. Like, I'm not doing the best job at showing these because I'm also like seeing them for the first time. So I'm only gonna open the House of Sky and Breath overlays, but just looking at these, I already know they ate. Are you kidding? They ate. They ate, they ate, they ate. I don't want any spoilers for people who have not read the series or plan on reading it, but I do have to say how impressed I am with Illumicrate for that. That is absolutely amazing. On that same note, we have a package from Fairy Loot, which I'm pretty sure is the Fairy Loot editions of the Crescent City series. Oh wow, so this is a completely different vibe. So, oh, I almost dropped it, but this is in a slip case and it's a completely different design on the spine. On the back, it says Fairy Loot and it has her signature. Let's open the first book of Crescent City. Oh wow, this is gorgeous. So this is a completely different cover. Oh my gosh, okay, so we have Bryce and we have Danica for the end pages. And of course, Fairy Lou did their signature prints on the hardback. And on the back, it says, Through Love All Is Possible. And then we have the same thing, but for House of Sky and Breath. And in the back, it says, Light It Up. And on the end pages, we have Bryce and Hunt. Ooh, Bryce looks good. Okay, she slayed that. Wow. I don't know who decided for us to start saying slay again but whoever you are i love you because i never wanted to stop using slay in the first place now that it's back i just feel like i can be me again fairy loot you killed that i don't know which one is my favorite i don't know which one is my favorite i love them both equally i think like they just are both so different but so very much a representation of the company that made them like fairy loots is just very specific to fairy loot like the complete cover change the edges the art the hardback and then with Illumicrate like their art oh they did the damn thing like I'm not even gonna lie I gasped when I saw that so I like both a lot I don't know it's gonna be really hard to choose favorite then I got this package from I believe Valentine PR or from the author herself and it's from Corinne Michaels oh my gosh it came with a note oh that smells so so good. It says Mika, I hope you love this small town single dad romance and all of the goodies. Thank you for your continued support, Corinne Michaels. <laughs> that was really sweet. I absolutely adored that. This candle is what smells so good. Okay, so there are literal overlays in this book. What is going on? So the book is called Forbidden Hearts and it's a small town romance and i will definitely be reading this soon the cover is actually really cute too thank you so much to corinne michaels for sending this to me i feel so special and i can't wait to read this okay so now we have this package that penguin random house sent and it literally says life's a beach read they asked me if i wanted to be sent a box with some cute summer items and summer reads and i was like do i i'll never say no to that we just we need to unpack this they sent super goop sunscreen okay if you did not know super goop sunscreen is actually some of my favorite sunscreen it's it goes on clear and it's just like absolutely amazing spf 40 which honestly you should use spf 50 and higher these super cute sunglasses and then they sent a penguin tote bag that is inspired by the midnight library and it says every book is a potential escape wait you are never trapped every book is a potential escape which is so true but this is a really good quality tote bag and i like it a lot they sent the midnight library by matt haig they then sent yinka where is your husband <laughs> that's actually a really funny title 
then they sent her majesty's royal coven by juno dawson i never heard of this oh this is an advanced readers copy and this is on sale this month actually it comes out on the 25th which like i don't even know when this video is going up let's see how fast i can edit it but it probably will be going up after the 25th. It's by Shari LaPena and it is called Everyone Here is Lying. She's the best selling author of The Couple Next Door. I don't know why that was such a mouthful for me to get out. That was honestly the best package in the world. Thank you so much to Viking Books for sending that over to me. And I'm pretty sure Viking is a imprint under Penguin, which is why I said both. Okay, so this is a, another Bloom Books package and they sent the Kingmaker duet by Kennedy Ryan. I've heard amazing things about Kennedy Ryan and her books. I've just never read them before. So I'm really excited to read this. So next up we have the Owl Crate June box, I believe. So the owl crate theme for june is if the fates allow it says the sea does not like to be restrained and then it has this beautiful necklace and it says the sea does not like to be restrained on the back of that as well so that is an enamel pendant and that is designed by keely studios next up we have treasure tomes which is a limited edition pin from the raven cycle so this is the pin and it actually opens up, which is so cool i feel like owl crate has done pins like this before and the pin was designed by noon e designs so we have this which i have no idea what this is but let's see I can open it that'd be great this is a hand mirror i love hand mirrors i use hand mirrors for my makeup all the time it's like the best way to get up close and personal and like make sure that everything is in place on the mirror it says i would know him in death at the end of the world this is the song of achilles hand mirror reflect on the tale of achilles and oh my gosh you guys are gonna be like girl you cannot say that name patroclus patroclus if i said that wrong please correct me but it says reflect on the tale of achilles and patroclus with the song of achilles inspired hand mirror for those who see the hopeless romantic in themselves that is i i am a hopeless romantic i'm really excited about this i get excited for the smallest things and this mini hand mirror is definitely one of them this is an, a ceramic trivet i don't know what that is so it says that's the joy of myths read the stories then make them your own and that is by neil gaiman i'm assuming you just like put stuff on here like hot drinks and that kind of stuff it's like a big ass coaster <laughs> what in the hell why won't this go back in there oh and then this is a i think this is a picnic blanket oh yeah from the scorpio races this is a picnic blanket how cute okay this is like perfect my camera cut off but my hair in the back was actually a bird's nest and literally no one told me so i don't know what to do with that information and i hope it wasn't like that for the whole video but if it was that's actually really funny anyways so i got to the book and it is threads that bind by kika hatsopulu i am obsessed with the what is this called the dust jacket <laughs> it's clear but the book itself is like the art on it i don't know i don't know how to describe this but this is absolutely gorgeous it kind of reminds me of my edition of Addie larue but in french which i think i have shown before on this channel but it looks like this and when you open it it's like faceless and this is her face oh, so well thought out in absolutely beautiful but yeah that was the owl crate box you can use code mika10 i believe to get 10% off of a book box subscription with owl crate and now we're on to the last box and i got this from aardvark book club and they offered to send me a box in order to give my honest opinion and they also gave me a code which i believe is just mika and that means that you guys can join the club for only four dollars for your first box which is crazy with free shipping i'm really excited to see what's in here and i mean if you guys like what's in here you literally can just use my code mika and get this box for four dollars immediately I love it. So it came with all of these bookmarks and a bunch of books. Oh, stop, I've been wanting this. Okay, so it came with Practice Makes Perfect by Sarah Adams. I've literally been wanting this. I'm so excited to read this. Same time next summer, and this is by Annabelle Monaghan. And then this is What Happened to Ruth Ramirez by Claire Jimenez. These are 
three books that you would literally be getting for four dollars if you use my code Mika. I do get affiliate with it but that is just absolutely amazing so I love this. Even the box is just so cute. It says think inside the box. I'm really 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 excited about this book though. All right well that was all the books that I had to unbox for you guys today. I really really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a comment telling me what your favorite book is from this video or what book you like the most from this video. If you made it to this point leave down a flower emoji in the comments. All my socials will be linked down below and I love you guys so much. I will see you all in the next one. Mwah. Bye! East and the west, I'm racking up on my breath, uh, power on me, I'm feeling just like a Tesla, too much tree, the smoke is making my chest hurt, girl on me, I'm thinking I should arrest her, Hey, I'm thinking I should arrest, all night long, she putting me to the test, got a lot on, I'm trying to take out the rest.